Hello friends, welcome back to my channel if you're returning. Welcome if you're new. My name is Rachel and I am a reseller on sites like eBay, Poshmark, and Mercari. And today I have another Quick Lots original mystery box. So if you want to see what they sent me this time, definitely stick around. So I purchased this box a few weeks ago and it actually was super random, but kind of super cool. And it actually has been super profitable to be honest. However, and I can link my original video down below if you want to see. But when I went to order another one, I realized that my box that they sent me was like the example box that they took pictures of and put on their website as like what you may receive. So it kind of had me thinking like, is my box really good because it's the one they put out as the example or was that just happened to be the one they took pictures of? So I ordered another one because now I'm curious. Plus two, I primarily sell clothing and, and things like that, clothing, shoes. And these are out of my comfort zone because it's basically everything but clothing and shoes. It's general merchandise and random stuff. It's like a thread up fun box for grownups, like seriously. Um, so anyway, it puts me out of my comfort zone and it gives me a little change of pace and they're really fun. So I decided to order another one. If you like reseller content, definitely make sure you subscribe. Um, every time I do an unboxing video, I do it live on this channel. I opened to this a little bit just to see like what was inside because I have several boxes I'm unboxing and I wanted to make sure I knew which one I was talking about today, um, but I haven't looked in it. So I always look in it first, give you my raw reaction, and then I come back 90 days later and tell you the results. I'll show you what's sold. I'll tell you how much it's sold for. And I'll give you my final verdict if I think it was a profitable box. Something like this, I want to double my money at least. So let's let's get into it. Uh, this is the Quick Lots Original Mystery Box. It's listed on their site, 30 pieces for $300, which brings me to $10 a piece, free shipping. So pretty straightforward. So I'm going to go ahead and open this up. Okay. Yeah, I can tell you right now, this one is just as random as the last one. But that maybe is not necessarily a bad thing. So here's what it looks like inside. Randomness all the way. Okay, so let's just start with what's on top here. These are Blue View 2. Total by Verizon. What is this? It's literally a cell phone. It's a cell phone. There is a legit, like... This is... <laughs> this is a cell phone. I have never tried to sell a cell phone. I don't know if I can sell this. I have no clue. This one might be a project for my husband who will probably be able to easily figure out if this is usable or not. I don't know if it's locked or or what. I Yeah. Ramona the radish. Oh. It's a it's a baby toy teether. Um I happen to have a baby who happens to be um, getting close to the teething stage. She's three months old. So this, I don't know, it's peeling a little bit. I don't know if that's supposed to happen. But I mean, it was $20 regular price. I'll have to see. I mean, I, I doubt it's worth listing. And since I could use it here in my house, um, I probably will just keep that. Um, <laughs> what even is this? Hold on. Hold on. Oh, it is a hat. This is a fur hat. Raised on the streets of New York. Oh, Kangle. It's a Kangle hat. And it's a size small, and it is faux fur, super random, $80 MSRP, and I mean, it was in the plastic, so, 
Okay. These are blue light glasses. Men's five piece set. Okay. Pink hat. Random pink hat. Oh, it's Ralph Lauren. Okay, so I'll tell you what, I'll, and I'm not going to open this right now. I had a Ralph Lauren golf hat in the last box, and it was one of the first things to sell. So that's fine. A Skims case. Is this just a case? Yeah, it's, it's, oh no, there's something in here. What is this? Oh, it's a, like a waist cincher. Okay. I don't know what this is exactly, but I'll have to look it up. It shouldn't be too hard to figure out. Um, $68 MSRP. I am not in the skims business. I know there are a lot of resellers that sell the crap out of skims. I am not one of those resellers. So that'll be a fun challenge. What is this? Whatever this is, is like a sealed box. Aw, uh, that means I gotta open it. What's it say? Hmm. Oh, these are tumblers. Oh, these are Starbucks tumblers. Ooh. And actually, there's another one in there. Okay. That's relatively exciting. They have an 1895 price tag. Um, I had some Starbucks tumblers in the first box I got. And they sold for retail price and then like plus shipping. So they actually sold for more than they were worth. I've got another PS4 game. I don't know what game this is. Fallout 76. Glass Elite for the iPhone 11 Pro Max screen protector. Um, this is some kind of jewelry. This ha Whatever this is has a $235 price tag. What is this? Oh, this is like bridal. Brides and hairpins. So this is a bridal hairpiece. $235. That's insane. Hey, I guess you know what though, if you're gonna if you're gonna do it up on your special day. Animal Crossing. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a Nintendo product. It says licensed by Nintendo, so I don't know what this is, but it's definitely sealed. So I have to figure that one out. Some BP jewelry, it says Aries. $15 regular price. Hand warmers. They're not expired, so that's good. I don't know how much they actually retail for. Ooh, Nerf gun. So random. Where's the, where's the darts? Oh, maybe they're in the bottom. Yeah, they're in the bottom. Like what good is a Nerf gun without the darts? But that's pretty cool. Okay, I got another one of these LSA. So I, I got one of these in the first box. Um, it hasn't sold yet, but it's like a super high-end tumbler. They're like 90 bucks or something. So I won't take it out of the box, but what it is on the front is exactly what it is inside. So um, 
Those are expensive. I've got a little mud pie. What is it? Oh, it's a muslin blanket. It's a little baby blanket with little reindeers and a little um, candy cane rattle. That's cute. That's a really nice gift. Straw hat. Treasure and bond. Probably not super exciting, but might be worth listing right now, seasonally. A random pair of Virginia Cavaliers pants, sweatpants, men's pants. That's random. Random, random. That's what this box is, though. Random. Like, I'm not surprised. Calcium supplements. Um, expires 624. So I actually got um, a men's testosterone kit in the first box, and I couldn't list it on any marketplace. It was like against the terms on every single marketplace. So it, did, it never got listed at all, and I almost wonder if this will be the same way. But I'll have to check. Um, this is a rocket book, Fusion Smart Notebook. Okay, so it's one of those like notebooks that the pen writes on it and then uploads to like a, a e-document. Okay. Self-cleaning slicker brush. Oh, for like pet hair. All right. Prismacolor art markers. So there's some markers. Gillette Pro Glide blades, replacement blades. Um, this one is a, well, what is this? That's a bummer. So it's an Isabel Marant belt. Has the sensor on it still. Has a last chance tag of $62, but it's got the, it's got the sensor on it. I have a whole box of stuff still with sensors on it that I, that I have to still try to get the sensors off. So, so this one is an ink set with only one thing of ink in it. Mabaku. I'm really sorry if I pronounced that wrong. I'm not into movies. Um, I know this is the from the Black Panther movie, but I probably did not pronounce that right. The box is all banged up, though. And with these Funko things, um, they're not worth much once the box, at least in my experience, they're not worth much once the box is all bent up. Another pair of sunglasses. Oh, these are Coach. These are bent, though. Look how bent those are. Bent and scratched. I don't know if I can do anything with those. More Funko. This one's not beat up as bad. This is from Target. And there's a t-shirt inside. Hmm. Woo, Taylor Swift album. Midnights. I got an album in my last box too. But this one is Taylor Swift. The other one was like Olivia Newton-John. So this one's definitely more current music. And then there's a couple other things in here. At the bottom. This is a watch band. Unbranded. It's just, it, it's just like a watch band. Oh, it's not unbranded. It is Kate Spade. Okay. Too Faced Ultra Fine Brow Pencil in Taupe. I got one of these in the last box. I still haven't sold it yet. And then there's a pair of 14th and Union earrings. They had a $9.97 retail price. Okay, so let me just quickly count and make sure there are 30 pieces. Okay, so I did count 32 pieces in here. That does include the cheap jewelry and, and everything. So... Um, my initial thoughts, that first box was way better. I mean, 
I was a little bit like WTF on the first one until I started looking up comps on some of the stuff. Um, and I'll keep the details for the 90 day update, but honestly, that first box is doing very well. This one, um, there are some high end pieces. One of the most high end items in the box though is, um, has the sensor on it. So there's a lot of Target stuff. I can tell some of the stuff is from Target. And if we look at each piece individually, there's a lot less in this box that was probably worth $10 per piece than the last one. Um, that's the luck of the draw though with the mystery boxes. You kind of get what you get. And for me, whenever I get a really good one and I try to order another one, it's definitely not as good like ever. <laughs> so um, I'm not necessarily surprised, but I am interested to see how some of this stuff sells. And like I said, if, for any, if anything, it's fun. It brings me out of my comfort zone. I get to like try some new stuff and and uh, that, you know, it helps me learn about things that maybe I should be looking for. So um, I'm going to go ahead and get to work on this. Definitely subscribe if you want to see the 90 day update or any of the other unboxing videos or 90 day updates that I have coming up. Drop me a like if you are still here. That certainly helps out my channel a lot. And thank you so much for watching. I will catch you in the next one.